Hello YouTube, I wanted to do a video real quick about a uh, comment that I got. Um, this was five days ago. I, I'm sorry, I've been terribly busy, so I, I'm just now actually seeing it. Um, but it says uh, Enhanced Pyrotechnics here uh, sent me this message. Um, <clears throat> that's actually a comment, a uh, channel comment rather. But it says, hey dude, thanks for your videos. Could you maybe do a tutorial on how to disable mouse acceleration deceleration in KDE Arch Linux completely? Okay. Um, I'm, used, I'm used to linear mouse movement as I always set that in Windows before switching to Arch KDE. But I can't disable it in the mouse options panel of KDE. Okay. Um, let's start there. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what you're referring to when you're when you're talking about linear mouse movement. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm just not understanding. You know what what you're trying to say here because, uh, you know, when when I think of mouse movement, you know, it's it's all linear. <laughs> you know, so I, I, and I'm not trying to be a a smart aleck or anything. I'm just I'm just saying. I'm I'm sorry. I just I I don't really understand exactly what you're referring to. But when it comes down to the acceleration and deceleration and how to maybe adjust that for your cursor I can certainly help you there um, if you go over here to your application launcher come down here to applications and then go over to your settings and then open up your system settings right and open up your system settings here scroll down to the bottom where it says hardware and input devices now this is where I assume I assume um, you said you went you went to before uh, where what did you say you, you couldn't you can't disable it in the mouse options panel of KDE. So I I am hoping this is what you're talking about. Here's the mouse, um, and then you know here it's not here. But if you go under advanced, you've got pointer acceleration. Now it's uh, by default. If I'm if I'm not mistaken, by default it's set it at two x speed. I'm not sure. Nobody quote me on that because I'm not absolutely certain. But regardless of what it's set on. If you set this to one, all right, and if my understanding is correct, set it to one, which is one x. My God, this is really slow now. It's, well, it's about half the speed. I guess that makes sense. But uh, one x, and then you click apply, you're going to see that your cursor is going to be, you know, quite a bit slower. But this is actually one x speed. This is this is your mouse speed or acceleration rather at 100%. Think of it like that because you take your speed and you multiply it by 1 and what do you get? You know, your your standard speed, right? If my understanding is correctly. It is correct rather. Now, if you set this to 2, click apply, you know, it's going to speed up twice as fast. Okay? The acceleration is going to be twice as fast. Um, you go 4. I'll show you that again. And it's yeah, it's zipping all the way across the screen. I mean, it's it's entirely too fast for my taste at 4x. So I'm gonna put this back down to where it's comfortable, which is 2x for me. That's where I keep it. But you're welcome to come here and play around with that and see if that doesn't take care of your issue. Now, um, you cannot set this to zero. If you set this, oops. If you set this to zero, it will always go to point one. Okay. So, oops. or not point 0.1 but it, it won't take a zero um, you can do point 0.1 you see but it will not let you do point 0.0 I don't think it lets you do a point zero zero one. no it's one decimal point only but if you do that that will literally slow it down to a degree um, I'm not really seeing really the point in going below one one is your max is your standard speed and then your acceleration goes up from there, right? So I'm going to set mine back at two. Click apply, and now it's back to a comfortable speed for me. So hopefully that has kind of helped you out and answered your question here. Let me go ahead and close this out. Okay, right there. Um, you're asking how to disable it. I don't know that you can disable it without unloading a module or something to that effect. I don't really recommend doing that. Um, simply because that that should be hard. I'm I'm thinking maybe maybe hard coded. Not not that there's probably not a 
not a setting or, or a command that you could maybe do or, or a file you can go in and um, and modify. I'm pretty sure that you can also maybe do it through uh, Xinit or uh, or some of the Zorg files. Uh, will probably allow you to go in there and, and manipulate it a little bit because that's that's your settings. Um, so you can probably do something like that. I would recommend looking it up. Just quick Google search and maybe you can find it. Um, but as far as acceleration, deceleration, if you want it at its normal speed, use 1.0 x on your acceleration. That should put it right about where you want it. And then you can just, like anything else in Arch and KDE, you can tweak almost anything. So hopefully that has helped you out. Now in the next video, I'm going to cover this next uh, this next comment, and uh, I'm going to give you guys a great tip as far as as far as using the terminal, so you'll want to tune in for that. So for now, hopefully this has helped you out, enhance pyrotechnics, and for anybody else that has had that question about mouse acceleration, deceleration, whatever, in KDE, um, if it has, if it has helped you out, um, please like and subscribe, and uh, stay tuned for future videos. Thanks a lot, guys.